and they're off. Many people major in simple everyday jobs, but Julie Crone chose a different career path. When I was a really young girl, um, the way I got into racing was um, I always rode horses. My mom was really instrumental in helping me learn about like the way horses respond to different types of um, treatment and stuff and how to communicate with them. She typically spends more time at home than at the stables, but this wasn't always the case. Being a girl, uh, there wasn't very many girl jockeys that were that successful, but I took on the kind of mental attitude towards it that I wasn't, I just wasn't going to participate with that and I could be a great jockey no matter what gender I was. In Colonial Affair, Julie Crone, the first woman to win the Belmont, she wins by two. Win after win after win, Julie Crone finally got where she wanted to be, into Racing's Hall of Fame. Each step, step by step, that would get me gradually up to the top of the racing world. A, a lot of wasted time is spent on uh, like trying to overcome obstacles. Um, you have to kind of make the obstacles work for you instead of against you. Overcoming obstacles and making her mark in history, Julie Crone has shown us that anything is possible. Reporting for VMS TV with photojournalist Ban Hamill, I'm Samantha Avalos.